Alrighty. Checking on the weather on this Tuesday. Yeah, we are. Ready to go. Oh, nice yeah. and calm and also milder this morning than yesterday. Um, no scraping on the windshield today. I'm loving that. Much milder. Yeah. Um, some are going to have to scrape inland, but Sorry. coastline is already in Sorry. the... Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Take it back. Right. Uh, some are already in the 40s, though, so it's it's kind of strangely mild. Shh, it's yeah. okay. Shh, shh, mm. it's okay. Don't say anything. You know what? Yeah. She might hear you. Who? Mother Nature. Oh, Mother Nature. Oh, yeah, let's, just not, leave her alone. let's not wake She's her up. She's forgotten right? about Maine right now, so I just want, leave her alone. <laughs> I want the level on my oil tank to stay right where it is for as long I'd, as possible. It's amazing. You know, the second floor of our house, I haven't turned up the thermostat up there yet because the heat, you know, rises yeah, yeah. and the first floor gets everything warm and it just goes right upstairs. So we've been in good shape so far. Um, here's your coastline I was just mentioning. A gunk with 46. At the jet port, it's 42, and you've got mid 40s down east into uh, mid coast areas, Wiscasset, Phippsburg, and Rockland right now. But if you go a couple of miles inland, you're running into some frost. Buxton's 32, Sanford Springvale 32, Act in the same, Gray's 31, Topsom 33, along with Lewiston Auburn. So you probably have to do some scraping this morning. And you know, that back deck might be a little slippery too, or if your front stairs are wood and they're, they're not kind of, you know, cement that's got a little bumps and grooves on them for some traction, they might be a little slippery too. So keep that in mind. Mid 40s down east right now, except in Cherryfield where it's 35, but 46 in Southwest Harbor. You get to Bangor 35, same in Orono. Colder in Belfast, Herman's below freezing. So is Dover Foxcroft, Waterville and Farmingdale also at the freezing mark. We're going to get rid of this chilly air mass pretty quickly and replace it with milder air. And when precip moves in, that means another rain event. This is like the fourth or fifth in a row. Still no significant sign for snow around here anytime soon. Clouds are already dominating a lot of the state. There'll probably be some bright spots and sunny breaks. Best chance for that is down east through the morning into the early afternoon. But I think largely today's going to be a gloomy day with the clouds hanging tough. Not much rain until the afternoon when scattered showers show up across the south and west and especially over in New Hampshire. And then after dark, we see more numerous showers scooting across the state. Tomorrow's the real wet day, though, with periods of rain expected. Look at the highs. The normal highs 41 way above that, and we're not even going to have any sun. This is incredible how mild this air mass is. Upper 40s for a lot of us, even up in the mountains and north, it'll be around 40. Not a ton of wind except at the coastline. You'll notice a breeze just like yesterday coming in off of the water. Tomorrow's wet from start to finish, but don't expect clearing until Thursday. When we get back into some sun, it'll be very warm. Chilly air mass replaces that for Friday in the weekend. And you know how I was talking about yesterday, the chances for a weekend storm were really small. Still looks that way to me. There'll be a storm out there, but we should have a blocking high protecting us. It won't protect us from the cold. It's going to be a chilly weekend. Highs only in the upper 30s around 40, and there'll be a gusty breeze out of the northeast too. But most, if not all, precip should stay offshore. So weekend plans are pretty good. You're not going to have any problems with slippery roads and plows aren't going to have to go out and treat them at all or anything like that. So that's good. There might be a little snow for snow lovers up in the mountains as the rain moves in at the start. We could get a little coating, so um, it's not a lot. It's not like we're gaining snowpack here, but we shouldn't lose a ton either. Marine forecast sees three to four southeast winds 10 to 20 knots. Mostly cloudy chance for an afternoon shower mid 40s periods of rain tomorrow in the mid 40s will clear out on Thursday. It'll be warm in the afternoon highs in the lower 50s. And then on Friday it's bright. It's chilly mix of sun and clouds 45 or so cold over the weekend. A little blustery too. can't rule out some flurries, but at the moment it still looks like that storm misses us okay. and we keep sailing along. OK, all right. Sounds good. Yeah. We're going to start wondering about a white Christmas soon, but we will. We don't have to worry yet. about that just got yet. Some time. All right. Thank you, sir.